Hello, my name is Dr. Michael Lightman. I'm the Chief of General Surgery and the Director of the Beth Israel Hernia Center. Inguinal hernias are common and affect men more than women. They can be present from birth or can be acquired as a result of lifting or activity. Usually patients experience pain in the groin area or may see a lump or a bulge. If symptoms occur, hernias should be repaired because internal organs can poke through the hole that exists in the muscle. This can rarely lead to a condition known as strangulation, in which those organs have their blood supply interrupted, which can cause severe injury and infection. Hernia repair is simple and very common. In fact, more than one million people per year have repair of inguinal hernias. The repair techniques are simple and very effective. Repairs are performed as an outpatient under sedation or general anesthesia and generally take less than one hour. The hernia repair is performed using artificial materials or mesh and can be done through a mini incision roughly the size of a large postage stamp. Or surgeons can use minimally invasive laparoscopic techniques. This video demonstrates a laparoscopic repair of bilateral inguinal hernias, which is commonly recommended for people with hernias on both sides, or for people who have had prior hernia repairs in the past. Patients having laparoscopic inguinal hernia repairs do require a general anesthesia so that the muscles of the abdominal wall are completely relaxed. The surgeon places a tube or port that measures roughly half an inch in diameter into the muscles near the navel. This allows the placement of a balloon which separates the muscles of the abdominal wall. Carbon dioxide is pumped into the port and additional instruments are placed through smaller incisions roughly the size of a pencil. The hernia sac is identified and removed. Organs such as the urinary bladder, nerves, and blood vessels are sometimes moved out of the way as well. In men, the blood supply to the testicle is oftentimes in that area and is preserved. The surgeon uses the mesh to reinforce the entire lower abdominal wall, and the mesh is secured to the muscles using dissolvable fasteners. After a few weeks, the mesh becomes incorporated between the muscles long before the fasteners dissolve. The gas is removed and the small skin openings are closed with dissolvable stitches. Small bandages are placed and the patients are discharged home the same day. At Beth Israel Medical Center, our hernia center utilizes the most modern techniques in order to get patients back to their normal activities as soon as possible.